Welcome back. Dawn arrived back home. A full moon had passed. He had come too late. A feverish delusion had overcome the land. The seer's messengers delivered dark dreams. Dreams of doom and peril. Doom. And peril. Hmm. In chains of Satanath. The seer had created his own realm of prophecy. He had? A desperate realm. Oh dear. Don't tell me we have to go there. Oh. Dark. A realm of fear. <gasps> Where? Oh dear. Oh. They are now. That's something Near his hideout. I'm back. But why is it snowing? It can't even be the beginning of Boron yet. Nuri. Is that her necklace? A cold welcome. Oh, these are her wind chimes. Thorny hedge. Why did Nuri have to plant these things right in my way? Yeah. Consideration. I hope I never go back to that world ever again. Let's hope so. Andres. Poor Nuri. Without her, none of her friends have survived the winter. Oh, no. What else was there? Plan. Nuri will be happy that at least something survived. After Hinkle, Finkle, and all the rest of the bunch have withered away without her care. Oh. Have I got things I have? I could cut through the thorny hedge, I suppose. Must I really fight my way through thorny bushes with bare hands now? Try your knife! <laughs> Try your knife! Yuri will forgive me. Alright. On you come through. Yuri will be happy that at least after Hinkle, Finkle and all the... Yep. One of the mandrakes has survived. So I took it. I just took it. Nuri will be happy that at least something survived. After Hinkle, Fink... Dinkle and... Jinkle. Rotten and frozen. You wouldn't even throw these to the swine anymore. Anything else I'm missing? Ooh. I see. There's something glittering inside. It must be made of water from the fairy well. There's something glittering inside. It must be made of water from the fairy well. Well, well, well. If I stick it in this... Of course not. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought I might have given it life. We might have a little friend. Do, do, do. Yuki, can't bring him to the side. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Place isn't looking too good, huh? Like the matted beard of old Cephal. Firmly attached. Shall we take it with the knife? Have you got some lighting? Like the matted beard of old... Yeah. And yes. I guess we're going this way. Oh, is that the knight? It is. He doesn't look too happy, does he? And uh, there's an old twig. Look, one twig has survived. A sign of hope. Dream on, boy. Or better yet, don't dream at all. Hmm. It must have slept through the beginning of winter. I took it. I took it. I took everything. Ooh, cobwebs. I love when cobwebs get frozen. 
The uh, knight from the Thash Mountains. He doesn't seem to have had a glorious return. He does not. Knight Rathling. What? Who? Don't you remember me? The farm in Thash Mountains last fall. It's me, oh, Geron. Yes, the pleasant boy with a beautiful girl. Time flies. Say, what happened to the girl? Hmm. Abducted. The seer has abducted her. The seer? Then she's doomed. I will save her. Wake up, boy. She'll have perished by now. No, he needs her alive. Nobody knows where the seer is concentrating his power. And anyone who eventually finds him would have to die horribly. Believe me, I know what I'm speaking of. You do? Why are you sitting here before the gates of the town? I have failed in my quest. I have disappointed the king and my country. I was in the search of the seer. He's back and foisting his dark crows upon the land. The madness has a grip on us all. Mm. Did you find the seer? No, but I was closer to him than almost anyone before. The further I rode, the more often I was watched by eerie creatures. Mm. Their soulless gaze burned on my back and sucked the life from my bones. Thus weakened, from I the very left marrow. my path to confront them in the dark. But they fought with unholy might. I could barely escape. They wanted to keep me as far away from their master as possible. I'm sure about that. So we've got, like, what would you call it? A job ahead of us? Tell me about the creatures who defeated you. Soulless creatures they were. Cold, relentless, and final. Like Boron himself. I, I, I don't want to think about it anymore. They were not from this world. What happened to Andergast? Mischief reigned upon us. Swarms of crows ravaged the land until there was only dead earth left. Are there even more now than there were last autumn? Whole tempests of crows! Ooh. Every night there are more and more. They say they bring the worst nightmares. Even in their houses, people aren't safe. Hmm. What does the king do about this threat? When he learned who was behind the plague of crows, he sent the most stalwart knights and many of the townsfolk to seek out the seer and finish him off. But alas, none returned victorious from this quest. If they even returned at all. And now I have failed as well. Where is the king? He's barricaded himself in the castle. It would seem the seer will finally fulfill his wicked plan even after 13 years. Okay. I don't have to listen to any more of this. No. Fairy scholar. Do you know if a fairy scholar has reached Andergast? A noteworthy guy by the name of Giacomo Norta. Never heard of him. You'd better ask at the Academy of Magic. They know these things better than I do. Oh, do you think we'll be allowed in this time? You're sitting here because you failed. I don't dare go back without having succeeded. It doesn't matter if I report or not. The doom for all can't be stopped now. But to stall and give up doesn't help either. Leave me. I have failed. I, I wouldn't have thought bearing me that burden would weigh much heavier on me than giving my life for my country. Oh, give me a hand. Night Rathling. Nothing. I thought we were asking for alone. help. Thank you. Hmm. That's it. Onward. Oh, look at himself. He doesn't look too happy either. Well, I suppose we'll go over and have a chat with him. Olgid, what are you doing with the pitchfork there? Ah! Ah! Go away! Leave me alone, nightmares! Calm down, it's me, Geron. Geron? You, of all people? When it's almost over? What's wrong with you? What happened to Ulfried? He's dead. I skewered him with the pitchfork. What? Why did you kill Ulfried? Yes. You think it's my fault, don't you? It is my fault. I hear them scream. Murderer! Murderer! There's nothing there, Olgir. Listen, why did you do it? I had dreams that I'd have to die because of him. Because of him! He always stared at me. With those pig's eyes of his. He grunted he was hungry over <laughs> and over again. I'm hungry! I knew he'd eat me neck and crop. He'd eat me if I didn't put the fork through his head. Maybe you should just give, give me the, me the pitchfork. pitchfork. No, it was lying here. It's mine now. You can have it soon. Yeah, I'll just use it. it once more. What 
do you mean by the end? I can't go on. I'll take my own life. Don't be foolish. The dreams, Geron. When I close my eyes, I see his grotesque face. He haunts me in my sleep. I am a murderer, Geron. And murderers have to die. No. Stop that nonsense. Give me the pitchfork. All will be well, believe me. I should listen to you, of all people. Maybe this is all your fault. Why should I listen to you? Trust me, it'll all sort itself out. Oh, yeah? I am a bird catcher. I will render those birds ineffective and then... Those crows stem from the nether hells. You can't do anything against them with a rotten net. I know, but Gwynling has found a remedy that changes them back into birds. Trust me. I don't know. Ulfried's death wasn't your fault. Hmm. All this is the seer's fault. He sent the crows. He is the cause of your nightmares. Yes, but I caused Ulfried's death. No, it was the seer. Without him, Ulfried would still be alive. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure myself. Come on, give me the pitchfork. No, this pitchfork is my last friend. It will silence my guilty conscience. Stop that nonsense. Give me the pitchfork. All will be well, believe me. I should listen to you, of all people. Maybe this is all your fault. Why should I listen to you? Wait a minute, didn't we do this before? Ulfried's death wasn't your fault. Hmm. Ah. It wasn't you who did it. Those crows hexed you. Hexed me? Yes. You wouldn't have caused Ulfried any harm, would you? So there must have been a curse that wielded the pitchfork using your hands. Do you really think? Yeah. Yeah. Trust me, it'll all sort itself out. Oh yeah? Didn't you always say that bad luck will befall Andergast if I didn't leave? Yes. But I did leave. Now see what happened afterwards? Yes, that's right. Couldn't that mean that I will write things after my return? But you'd have to trust me first. Do you really think? Yeah. Hand it over. Come on. Give me the pitchfork. Maybe you're right. Very well, then. Take the pitchfork and clean it. What if I get nightmares again? Then challenge your fear. Try to understand it. Bow, bow. Yeah. This jug started the whole thing. It feels like that was years ago. I need your jug, Olgierd. Just take it. Take everything you can find. All right, then. Ooh. It must have slept through the beginning of winter. Of all people, I must save Olgierd's life. Hmm. Um. You clean it with this? Nonsense. Hmm. How do I clean it? All the ways to go. I can go straight in without going up. Oh, let's clean here anyway, just in case. Look! So, I'm back. The picture! The picture is fading more and more. It's fading, it's in bits! If you knew what I've been through. Ooh. Needle and thread. I'll stab out the seer's eyes as revenge for what he did to Gwynling. Good idea. I had planned to make a doublet of this once, in order to be accepted by Olgierd's bunch of patriots who sported the colors of Andergast. Luckily, I lacked the patience to finish the job. Should we do it now? Perhaps Nuri can make a dress from this later. Hmm. Oh. Bird droppings. That's where the scent is coming from. 
time to clean out. There's one dove's egg left. Hmm. Looks like we're going to be trapping something. Gwynling's small compendium of plants. Could come in handy. What's written here? The print is so small. I must find the harp. I'm certain the seer keeps her captive there. Gwynling used to brew his peculiar potions in this. Can you get the all there? It's already broken. Oh, sorry. The wrong one. Aha. Gwynling used to brew his peculiar potions in this. He sure did. I can heat up the brew with this. It's perfect where it is. Brew, where am I, where am I brewing? Mandrake, oak, and an egg. Oh! This. Gwynling's small compendium of plants. Does it tell Gwynling's me? Gwynling small compendium no. of plants. It ain't telling me nothing. So let me see what is in here. I have to make sure it really is an ingredient for Gwynling's recipe. Well, how, do, how do I make sure then? Gwynling's small... How do I look at it? Gwynling didn't want me to look in there, but he'd understand. That was the whole point of that. It's completely wedged in. Perhaps I can break loose the bottom of the drawer, but not this way. One. Ah. An empty drawer doesn't need a bottom. Everything. Gwynling's remedy against the crow's curse. Aha! Uh -huh. Gwynling's remedy against the crow's curse. I need one mandrake, yep. one yaruga, two ounces of thrash beard, something that attracts crows, and something that contains fairy magic. In brackets, presumably, all of that together is heated in a glass bulb. Completely wedged in. I think I have two of those ingredients. It's completely wedged in. It must have slept through the beginning of winter. The grooves are too narrow to break the drawer loose with the fork. Place the glass bulb in Gwynling's kitchenette first. Okay. You got an egg. Something that attracts crows. Yep. Mandrake. One mandrake. What were the other two things? This stuff, anyway. Something that presumably contains fairy magic. And two what now? No. 
Gwynling's remedy against the crow's curse. I need one mandrake, Got it. one yaruga, two ounces of thrash beard, something that attracts crows, and something that contains fairy magic. In brackets, presumably, all of that together is heated in a glass bulb. So I have two items. One arugula? Is that what he said? And two thrash beards. Okay, anything else? I'd like to be able to get that draw. Oh, he did it. Hopeless. Oh. I'm not sure it's even possible to cut that. How about we break it like we broke it before? For the sake of old times. Okay. Can I use the shard? I'd better keep it. Okay. Clay and lichen. Wherever did I get that idea? I don't know. I'm grasping. I guess we have to go into town. Go this way. Well, oh, there's his dead body. He didn't even put him away. I wonder what happened to Hilda. Deserted. That's Olgird's friend, Ulfried. The Raven will have to pay for every single dead body. Um, is that it? Wasn't there a way over here? Whoa, there's someone in there. goes there? What purpose does he have? I am Geron, the bird catcher. What do you want? Let me into the academy at once. Forget it, boy. Only authorized persons may enter. You see what's going on outside, don't you? What happened? Where did all the people go? Did you sleep through the last months? The crows have brought madness that has a grip on the whole land. Those who are still of relatively sound mind barricade themselves in their houses. The seer really isn't wasting any time. Is Giacomo Norta in the academy? Who? A memorable guy with two different colored eyes. He should be here. Oh, that agitated chap. Yes, <laughs> he's here. Agitated chap. <laughs> How can I get access to the academy? A commoner like you won't get access at all. Not even the chancellor of the academy may come and go without reason. A non-magician like you would have to receive a charter from the king himself. Then that's uh -huh. what I'm going to do. <laughs> An audience with the king? You? And in these challenging times, the king has barricaded himself behind walls like everybody else. Okay. See you later. I'd rather not. Well, the crows haven't left anything of the town's banner. If the crows do this to every town's banner, it would make great bait. The 
crows haven't left anything of the town's banner, almost as if they knew what it means to us and Agastians. Away with this rag. Wait a minute, away with the rag? Make great bait. I could hang this up. Green oak twig and red crown on a white background. If I want to make the banner anew, I'll need those three things. Say it again. Green oak twig and red crown on a white background. If I want to make the banner anew, I'll need those three things. Green cloth and brown oak twig. But for the town's emblem, I need an oak twig of green cloth. No, what use is that supposed to be? That's just have a bit of white background. Crows haven't left anything of the town's banner. Home. A bird catcher needs two things: a proper trap and the right bait. We're working on the bait. Uh, proper trap is another story. I'm out of ideas. Hmm. What else? Kroger? Who? Geron? The bird catcher? You can't do anything here. Those critters can be caught by no one. You'd better go. There's time to flee yet. Let me see the king at once. Don't <laughs> be ridiculous. Nobody sees the king. The mischief the seer has brought upon us is taking up all his attention. That's exactly why I'm here. In these days, doom reigns over oh, and the best there, there. It'll be best if you run away. Far Play. away. You are still young. It has to be possible to gain admittance to the king. As long as the crows are wreaking havoc, nobody is admitted to the castle. You look tired. I haven't had any sleep for days. Why not? A crow attacked me. Since then, I've been suffering from terrible dreams. That my wife dies during childbirth. <laughs> that my daughter vanishes forever into the woods. Both dreams came true. I'm sorry to hear that. You'd better go. There's time to flee yet. Hmm. What else? More crows. Crows everywhere. How am I going to get the herbs? I'll never be able to do that. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Yes. Now I've got a peace envoy's flag, which I won't need because I'll kill the seer. What's this? This route seems to have survived. Is it, uh... What you call it? Oh, I don't know. It says I'm gonna help some. Hilda will know how to take care of herself. She will. Hilda will know how to take care of herself. Hilda will know. Yes, yes. We know. Hilda will know how to take care of herself. Um. Green and white, the colors of Andergast. Green and white, the colors of Andergast. But it ain't going. I need to get an oak, an oak, th an oak tree with it? No. Green and white, the colors yes, of... Yes, 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 yes. 
It doesn't work that way. Sorry. A root. A root. A root. A root. I thought it says arugula or something at the, that time. When, um... He was looking for his recipe. Is it a root? I have to make sure it really is an ingredient for Gwendolyn's recipe. Oh, okay, so it isn't. Um... Gwynling's remedy against the crow's curse. I need one mandrake, Check. one yaruga, two Yuruga. ounces of thrash beard, okay. something that attracts crows, and something that contains fairy magic. In brackets, presumably, all of that together is heated in a glass bulb. Yaruga, whatever yaruga is. Um... Of course not. This will yield nothing. What am I supposed to do? I ain't got a clue, Garon. So the story with you. Night Rathling. Those peculiar crows. They must have a weak spot. Every bird can be lured or scared off by something. Hmm. When I came back to the town, the crows were madly attacking the pennant at the end of my lance. All I could salvage was a shred of it. No, oh, give it to me. Give me the remains of your pennant. The escutcheon is worthless. Andergast will perish. Come on, just give me the shred. Oh well, you can take it. I'll leave you alone. Thank you. Cool. Red crown on a white background. Now all I need is a green oak twig. I need a green twig for the escutcheon. Did I do it wrong? Did I do it wrong? Did I? Huh? No. It's the other way around. I need to focus on the task. But, 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 I need a green twig for the escutcheon. I need a green twig for the Of course not. Gwynling would not have... No time for such things. I need a green twig for the escutcheon. I have the red crown. Now all I need is a green oak twig. I have the red now all I need I have the red crown now all I need is a green oak twig I need a green twig for the escutcheon Gwynling's remedy against the crow's curse I need one mandrake, one yaruga, two ounces of thrash beard, something that attracts, and something in bracket, all of them. I have to think, bird catcher. That's Olgierd's friend, Ulfried. The raven will have to pay for every single dead body. The only one who can grant access to the academy is the king. I need a green twig. 
wait for the escutcheon. It should be on that, and I can't get it on it. Okay. A green oak twig. The town's emblem. Now I just have to sew the pieces together. Let's get going then. First the crown. Tough. Then the oak twig. And that's how you make a banner. Great. But how do I catch them? I don't have a net. Hilda will know how to take care of herself. Not a very bright idea. I don't want to get the other stuff though. I hope this remedy does what Gwynling hoped it would. needs two things. Yeah. A proper trap and the right bait. A proper trap. A proper trap. Maybe. No. no. This doesn't yield. Doesn't work. I can do better than that. Another ingredient. What? What's another ingredient? Another ingredient. Really? What? How is that another ingredient? I, I, I fail to see how that's another ingredient. Sure, it really is an ingredient for Gwendolyn's recipe. Another ingredient. Gwendolyn would not approve. A root. Another ingredient. I don't get this. What for? This has to do. Not a very bright idea. I can do better than that. I have no clue what I'm doing. I can repeat that till I drop now. It isn't going to work this way. Another ingredient. Like the matted beard of old Cephal. Not this way. I can't think of anything here. I could really use some sleep. I could really use an idea.
any other night rattling those peculiar crows every bird can be lured hmm. when I came back to the town all I could see I'll leave you alone thank you to that world ever again. I can do better than that. Well, you didn't say clean it. <laughs> At this stage, I'm kind of grasping at straws. Nonsense. Hang that, but I don't have a trap. Not this way. I don't think so. No time to experiment. Oh, I'm just going back. Remedy does what Gwynling hoped it would. Gwynling's small compendium of plants. Gwynling's remedy against the crow's curse. I need one mandrake, one yaruga, two ounces of thrash beard, something that attracts crows, and something that contains fairy magic. In brackets, Presumably, all of that together is heated in a glass bulb. Another ingredient. That's weird. Can I find out from the Let's book? see. <gasps> Grayish green lichen bewitched forest. Lichen. This has to be Thrashbeard lichen. Ah, so identify. Let's see. Grayish green lichen bewitched forest. Oh. This has to be Thrashbeard lichen. I use the same thing again. <laughs> Let's see. Pale yellow root, celery like leaves. Without any doubt, a Yaruga root. Oh. One Yaruga? Okay. Running all over the place Two looking for stuff. Of thrash beard. I'd have it with me the whole time. Uh, reverse there. Oh, okay. There. Finished. Now those ghastly crows only need to touch it. Ouch! Hot. Oh, yeah. Uh, I, I can that. heat up the brew. It's exactly where it should be. So what should I oh, to touch it? So should I put this on this? <sighs> Come on, you can do it. You can do it. I can wind it up and down with the crank. With it. Huh. He's doing it himself. Ah. 
indeed. Oh, castle dwellers, I've just noticed your little work of art, boy. The king wants to see you now. Excellent. Perhaps he's gathering new hope. Finally. Hello, king. I mean, your majesty. Truly an incredible story, bird catcher. So you're saying that the raven is the seer? Every day this bird approaches me and demands the ring of the burnt one. He will cast Andergast into eternal darkness, just like he did with Nuri's fairyland. You're displaying great boldness in showing up in front of your king after you vanished so unexpectedly. But don't misuse the woes of my land as an excuse for your own failure. This time I won't go away, my king. If Nuri dies, I'll lose everything I have left. Do you think you're the only one who feels helplessness and despair? Lust for revenge and wrath makes us blind, like way back when. Thirteen years ago, perhaps we were the blind ones, not the seer. Hmm. Well, well. The king and the bird catcher. A display that could be from a fairy tale. Where have your shining knights gone, my king? Spare your sarcasm, seer. You have been uncovered. <laughs> you believe what the bringer of bad luck is telling you? Hmm. Why should I mind? I have torn the veil of time apart, and I have looked sat enough himself in the eye. Fate is riding in. Unstoppable. It's standing right inside your throne room, even now. Enough of that. What do you want? You know my offer, King Wraithling. Give me the ring, or fall into eternal darkness together with remnants of your realm. Decide. What shall it be? My king. Silence. You want my decision, seer? You shall have your ring. I will personally crown your ashes with it as soon as you are <laughs> burnt for good. <laughs> <laughs> no, little king. That is not the conclusion that I see. We had hoped it would end when we burnt him. But now, I'm not sure anymore. What if the prophecy concerning you is true? Nuri will die if I can't find her. No matter if I bring bad luck or not, nothing will keep me from saving her life. Your steadfastness warrants respect, but you are only human. Do not expect much help from me. Too many men I've sent to their death already. Your Majesty, grant me admittance to the Academy. This nice. shall be my only plea. The Academy? What do you hope to achieve there? I have to talk to the Fairy Scholar and find out more about the Magic Harp. Your heart seems to be in the right place, Geron. I will give you a written pass that identifies you as my envoy. Be thanked a thousand times, my king. Good luck, Birdcatcher. I hope you'll be able to save your friend. Woohoo! I'm curious about what the guard will have to say about this. Let's find out. In the next episode. Where do I go? Do I leave it there? I think it's it's been a while. I should probably leave it. <laughs>